A complex number, let's call it A, is a real number, such as 3, plus another real number, such as 2, times the imaginary unit labeled i. For this example, 3 is the real part of a, and 2 is the imaginary part of a, even though 2 is a real number. It's next to the i. What is i? It's a symbol that has the property that when you square it, you get negative 1. How do we know that such a number exists? We essentially define it to exist, and we'll see that it has a consistent and beautiful arithmetic. We'll also see that complex numbers have a consistent and beautiful geometry associated with them, based on the natural association between a complex number and rectangular coordinates in the plane. The complex number 3 plus 2i is completely determined by the real part 3 and the imaginary part 2. Therefore, those numbers can be thought of as rectangular coordinates. It's then very natural to use the words real and imaginary as the labels for our axes in a rectangular coordinate.